damn. <laughs> oh my god. Welcome, everybody. Welcome. Oh wait, Apparition Boy Dweller Nagels and Jess to Art and Elico 2. Yes. Uh, <laughs> a bit of a new one. Uh, I, I figured that, uh, you know, I love visual novels so much, but I, I don't, the last thing I want to do, you're right, it does, it does remind me a bit of um, uh, the Umineko song. Uh, YouTube says it's not getting enough data, but seems fine to me. I'm getting a green on OBS right here, so I have no idea what YouTube is saying here. I don't know why YouTube is saying that. <laughs> oh, well. Anyway, I figured that, you know, oh God, no, 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 no. <laughs> don't replay it. It's a very long song. <laughs> yeah, 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 that did sound extremely familiar to the Umi Naku, uh, singer. As I thought, as I told you guys, everything in this channel, somehow, some way is going to lead back to Umi Naku. And uh, thank you, Apparition. Everything's coming in fine. I was just about to ask that. I was worried about the volumes. This was recommended to me by our, our lovely moderator, Guppy Force. And uh, she just absolutely adores this game. And I figured that, you know what? I think the channel is due for a bit of a change of pace. And uh, uh, the, the, yeah, there's no need to uh, play number one first before two, she said. And uh, although I did play number one ages upon ages ago when it first came out, I barely remember it. I remember just enough about the world of Artinelico to... God damn it. Let me finish my goddamn intro. <laughs> to to uh, make the title for this stream. But anyway... It's a turn-based JRPG. I believe it's voiced. I know the, I know the first one was. So uh, we'll see what happens here. I already, I already, uh, I turned on. I didn't uh, view the intro last time just to fuck with some settings here. Let's go. Let's get into it. I want to see what this is all about. Okay, so, yep, since the voices are in Japanese, God, this is really loud for me. Let me just turn it down a bit. I can, uh, for myself, I can still give voices to everybody. Woo! You have caused me a lot of trouble. A three year old. How sad. Give back Rika! I have no idea who this character is. I, I wish they had um, a pro. Uh, cut in some sprites. Ooh, damn. Luca! Luca! Kisamara ni wa nasake ta yu mono wa nai no ka? Bastards. Have you no compassion? Shoumai wa haijo suru dake da. Wori teki na kangae kata da to omo ga no? <laughs> Obstacles can only be removed. That is my most rational mindset, in my opinion. Uh. Yeah, I think this guy's a bit older, now that I see his fright yet. Rita, take Luca with you and run away. Hey, Guppy Force. <laughs> oh, good, he has a sprite. Uh, okay, there we go. Hurry! Uh, uh, all right. Luca, we have to run. Please don't die. Daddy. Oh God. See. No. Give back Rika! <laughs> That's an impossible request. 
That this child is infected with IPD. Furthermore, she is a first class one. I've never seen such a pure infection. This is something that needs to be researched in detail for the future of the world. Scumbag. What are you going to do with my daughter? Hello, Estalior. Welcome to the stream. Well, nothing in particular. We won't kill her or anything. We just want her to show us her reaction. Bastards! I won't let you do what you want to Reika! We can have a fight? Oh, no. We've made it this far. We should be all right now. <laughs> so it looks like she had a sister. Or something, I guess. A sister or a best friend. Reka? Johnny? I'm guessing Reka's is the blonde girl from the opening. <laughs> yeah, because she's blonde, so they might be sisters. Luca. Yep, Onei-chan, yep, she's the older sister. Wake up! I couldn't protect you! I'm sorry, Mika. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. You did a very good job today, Luca. You're a wonderful big sister. It's okay. Daddy will surely bring Rika back. Really? Yes, of course. Luca? You know it too, right? Daddy is really strong. Yeah. So, don't worry. Luca? Luca? I guess she fell asleep. Luca. Are you sleepy? Just so loud, but... Oh, God. But I'm gonna win to Rika. And Daddy come back. So... So then... All right. Then, do you want to sing a song with mommy while we wait? sister is going to grow up with the mom and the other one is going to be captured. Harsh world where natural land no longer exists. Uh, uh, 
tried many times to make the Metapalica their legend of reality, because every time they tried it was prevented by the goddess, guessing that's the final boss. The goddess unleashed a terrible curse upon this world. A curse which undermined the raven tales, a race that can release magic through singing. People stopped defying the goddess, and Metabalica once returned to legend. <laughs> this won't be the first goddess I've slain. Making a cheese fire at Monster Houses. Four hundred years later, what? The people of the world began calling their own home the Cursed Lands. Music's really nice. Damn, so 400 years after that whole kidnapping? Amun Dias, 3772. And now history is about to undergo a great change. Total command. <laughs> then presto and gus. Oh, the kidnapping is only a few years before. I can't read that. God damn it. It's too tiny. This screen is a bit tiny. This art style reminds me of uh, Final Fantasy Tactics. Oh, cool, I get to use this. Oh, wow. I love her voice. People of the Grand Bell Hall. People of Metafals. Now is the time to stand up. The end of the age of obeying the goddess is approaching. Our time of coexistence with her has ended! Four hundred years ago, she rejected the realization of our paradise, Metaphalica, and oppressed us all. Damn. This is the kind of scene I would expect near the end of the game. Wow. Holy shit, jeez. I was not expecting this to be the opening scene. Holy, oh my god. <laughs> wow, okay, you got me hooked already. And since then, the relationship we had with the goddess was one of coercive dominance over us. <laughs> However, how can we be satisfied with this situation? What paradise can be found in our current land? We, the Neo Grand Bell, declare our success, uh, secession from this land, ruled by the goddess. Did I skip to the end of the game somehow? Because, wow. Since we can no longer rely on her, we must create our own happiness by our own power. For that, we aim to create an independent metaphors. This is Choco's voice actor? Are you serious, Nagels? Holy shit. Wow! Oh my god. It's seriously, Miyuki Shomashi. Oh my 
god. Wow, no wonder I love her voice. Beloved citizens, to meet that goal, here we demonstrate our determination and sincerity to you all. We declare war on the goddess! And our secession from her rule! Unlike those clergy dogs of the former government who are faithful to the goddess, we promise you action and responsibility! Let us together create Metaphalica, the Green Land! Let us create Metaphalica, the Green Land! But not Greenland, because that's icy. Damn. Wow. This is the beginning? Okay. Page one, Postalia. Sounds delicious. battle already. How to, oh, okay. Uh, uh, I don't know who, Cro Croy, I'm guessing. Attack and defense phases, will, yeah, I remember this. We'll cycle back and forth during a battle. When you press the square or X button, you will perform an action. Square button to the character at the top. X button is for the one at the bottom. During attack phases, you will attack the enemy. In this battle, you only have Croy at the top, so use the square button. If you hold up, down, or left at the same time as pressing square, the attack the form will change. Like a fighting game? I wonder how that affects them. Maybe some enemies are weak to certain types. You can attack as many times as you want. The action time you have per turn. Action time will continually decrease during an attack phase. Oh wow. So it's kind of like an ATB, but you get to do whatever you want during that. Interesting. Rather than take one action. I'm guessing I do remember that some things take uh, time to charge up. The meter surrounding the indicator at the bottom right shows how much time you have left. There it is, yes. When the meter runs out, the defense phase will start. Until then, take as many actions as you can to deal more damage to the enemy. The Battle Basics 1 tutorial has been added. You can check this tutorial, blah blah blah. Okay, let's go. No sound effects. Oh god. Oh no, what happened to the music? Uh-oh. Did I think my headphones just died? Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh no, never mind. I just muted the sound for some reason. I don't know how that happened. My sound just got muted. Your time has run out, so now it's the defense phase. What the hell? It's... Every time I press A on the control, it's muting the sound? Are you fucking serious? Wh why is it doing that? During this phase, enemies will perform a predetermined number of actions. You won't be able to counterattack until they have finished. Please do your best to endure their attacks during this time. I can't do any kind of defense. Oh wow, that... Damn. Oof. She's a Ravitale. Okay, that's way better. There we go. Dead. Oh god. No! I thought... Damn. Bad guy? 
No, please don't take my child away. So you walk in your Ikonainda. We don't have a choice. IPD ni consent to Reva Tail got a hot of Kenka, Juben Shots Terdaro. IPD infected Reva Tails are very dangerous, as you should know by now. Oh God! I understand, but, but this daughter, this child's my friend's daughter.気持ちはわかるけど、今回のこの子一人で三棟倒壊、死者五名を出したんだ。ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、
Were you perhaps up to something with this girl? My god, what do they think of Crow? <laughs> <laughs> My god, everybody's just assuming stuff about him. No, 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 no. Me and Sir Crow are like, uh... We don't have any kind of relationship. Yes, that's right. We don't have any kind of relationship. Damn, yeah, I was about to say that. Huh, <laughs> you're really cold. Oh, well, too bad. But anyway, you must be tired after this mission, Kroa. Seriously, there's been way too many dispatch orders. It's kill lately, it's killing me. Well, at least we have the small consolation of being in the same squad as Kroa, right? How's that? Kroa, the ace of the Grand Bell Knights. The promising newcomer. Uh, enough already. Captain Leglius always said all also says it, right? People as talented as you only appear once in a decade. Even short if we do our work badly, Lord Crow will finish all of it. Oh, <laughs> so they just jump all their work on him. So you say that we can sit back and relax, eh? What? You're awful. You guys are so rude to Lord Sir Croa. <laughs> <laughs> You're supporting Crow way too much, eh? What? It's not like that. Oh, does he? Don't bother with him. He's already got one of his own, you know. Huh? Oh. Is that the girl you're always with? Shimata. Kokona Matasa Irunata. Ah damn, Kokon is waiting for me. What kind of crazy ass JRPG was is this? We already we're already gathered everybody against the goddess. The protagonists have a girlfriend has a girlfriend. Dogs and cats living together. Like so what the actual fuck? Holy shit. Tsumanai, Sakini Kai. Okay, wow! Uh, sorry, I have to go back now. I'll leave the report to you. Oh, it's not Kokona. Okay, I see. No, it's not Kokona. There's another one, a real one. Oh, okay, well, he does have somebody. Oh, this is what he looks like. Interesting. He's kind of he's kind of a nerd. <laughs> I didn't expect that from his other sprite. Uh, sorry, I'm late. Oh, I see. This is like his little sister or something. <laughs> You're late. You're really late. Boo! Boo that! Though, this time it was a really serious case. Actually, I, I think I'm not giving the George voice. He does not look like a battler at all. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely, I think I'm gonna give him the George voice. 
I see. As always, you did a good job, eh? Shame that I couldn't help you today. Crow? Are you okay? Uh, 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 yeah, I'm fine. He is a knight after all. The aftertaste. Hmm? Huh? The aftertaste of, the aftertaste it leaves is bad, huh? The IPD containment missions. Ah, so that. Yes, it is. Hey, did you join the knights to do these kind of things? Yeah, I No, I. I was in the Knights. I joined the Grand Bell Knights because I admired the goal of creating the new green land, Metaphalica. But actually, I only ended up performing IPD containment missions. Isn't that the way of the world, eh? That's awful, huh? Well, at least we're standing up and doing something for people. Besides, if I wasn't doing this job, I'd never have met you. <laughs> oh, so she's not his sister. Huh. I guess maybe adopted sister or something. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Come on, let's go shopping. If we don't hurry, the stores will close up. <laughs> Don't you think you've bought a little too much? What are you saying? Oh, is Luca his girlfriend? Oh, Luca was the girl who was kidnapped. Who? Was, oh, wow. Luca was the girl who was uh, brought to safety in the beginning. Since Luca is coming tomorrow, didn't you say that we needed to make good food? Yes, but you think well, that we'll be able to eat all of this? <laughs> don't worry about small details. Well, let's hurry to the next shop. Isn't it getting dark already? Huh? There's another place we have to go. Oh, come on. Didn't I tell you that we were going to the Suruya weapon shop? They finished making my new armor and I haven't been able to go pick it up. Ah, so It's not. Oh. I see. Sorry. But I really dislike going to that weapon shop. Oh, it's like that. I thought you always had to go, uh, had fun there. Enough already. Well, at any rate. Let's hurry up and go to Suruya. Astalia City has been added to the town map. Da 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 da. Okay. Oh. Uh. 
Okay, um, I guess I'll go to Vestalia City then. Oh, right to the armor shop. Oh, she's really cool. Oh, cool! Welcome. And Kakona too? You seem happy today. Don't tell me you made something strange again. Wow, cool. You're amazing. I guess that with the deep bonds that connect us. Y'all know everything about me, huh? Damn, everybody loves him. <laughs> wait, wait a moment, sugar. I... Y'all can't leave yet. Window shopping is forbidden here. Anyway, how can I help y'all today? I'm here to pick up the armor I ordered. Oh, that's right. Your order. Hold on a sec. Here it is. Obtain girls' clothes, even though it's supposed to be armor. Wow, thank you. But, are y'all sure this armor is good enough? I mean, if y'all leave it with me for a little longer, I could make it much better. No, no, no. I'm okay with this. I better make something for Crow. Don't point her to me. Oh, y'all are so sweet, Kokona. It's so nice that y'all are supporting your brother and his love life. I see. All I see is an evil sister who is sacrificing a big brother's life. Damn. He's kind of a jerk a bit. <laughs> but, you know, people are, you know, putting everything on him, so you can't fully blame him. What? What's that supposed to mean? Ku, y'all better mind your tongue. You're talking as if I only make failures, I'll get you killed. <laughs> oh my god! Am I wrong? Hmm. Nah, he, he's. Mi Sorry, I'm just gonna, you know, like, while I slowly get a voice for him, maybe he's more of a um, Michelle than, than a George. Because he's, he's very assertive. Oh, that hurts. Oh, fine then. If y'all are gonna talk like that, I can't back down now. Honestly, I would have preferred that. Yeah, I, I think Michelle uh, fits in better. I'm gonna make a really strong weapon for the next time y'all come. I'll be waiting for you, <laughs> and I'll be dressed to kill, okay? That's a somewhat worrying choice of words. Can't I, can't I talk you out of this? Use the equip command to equip weapons, armor, blah, blah, blah. Yes, okay. I've played RPGs before. Let's see. Can I walk around? Cynthia was as unique as ever. 
I'm getting quite used to her. But if Luca sees the relationship between you two, won't she get jealous? Yeah, No, I don't think so. Oh, really? Luca was so you got the wall, put on a good enough. It's Luca's not the type to get mad about things like that. What's wrong? Hey, so what kind of person is she? Really? His adopted sister has never met her. Interesting. This again. Well, the more you hear about her, the less I understand her. She's a nice, good girl. It's because you say things like that! That doesn't answer my question at all! Oh wow, oh wow, so they're that serious. Holy shit! Wow! This game is insane. What? Oh my god. We'll find out soon enough when we start living together. But then it'll be too late. So I'm asking now. This is so. Anyway, so with this all shopping for today. Yeah, that's all. Now let's go home. Crowba's house has been added to the town map. Okay. Oh, I can walk around. Can I run? Hey, it's Tweedledee and Tweedledum. All right. Hey, Crow, have you finished your work for today? Uh, can you finish mine? No, I'd rather not. Saruya is the best equipment shop ever. As long as you don't say it's the best equipment shop that's ever lived. Oh, which way should I go to reach the center? Whoa! I'm not answering that. I'm really glad she wasn't an IPD. Not knowing how the infection spreads makes it quite dangerous, huh? Oh my, hearing a youngster scream gives me quite a bad feeling. I can't forgive how they take away innocent children and that crying and shouting. Damn. What's this? Is this? I hope this. Oh, this is another place. Oh, what the fuck? Dive, what's that? Oh my god, what is this? This is like a vocaloid. This is reminding me of that one song. Oh wow. Welcome. Do you wish to dive? No, I'm fully dressed. Uh, oh, oh, uh, no. Damn, it reminds me of that one fucking song. I think uh, I do want to get the true ending if there is one, but uh, I, any any I'm not gonna I don't think I'll do 100% in this type of game, but I, I'll do I'll try to do all the all to get all the dialogue and the quests. Oh, so this is what a dive shop looks like inside. Huh? Is it the first time you visited a dive shop, my little lady? Yep, I've never been to one before. Well, there's no real reason for you to go, to do so, to do so though. Hey, Crow, what are you doing to dive? Huh? Well, um, um, allow me to explain. 
A dive is the act of going inside the mind of a ravetail to craft song magic. I think I remember this in the game. It's like freaking AI the Somnium Files kind of thing. It might be easier to understand if you tried it, but basically it feels like going on an adventure through a mind. The dangers you might face, the obstacles you have to overcome, all while two people deep in their bonds. Whoa! I can't even try it out. Oh, but you need to have a Ravitail partner to, to, to die. Ravitail? Kokona, let's go now. Oh, okay. Well, come again once you've made friends with a Ravitail. Okay, thanks, Miss. Dives are always full of dreams. Damn, that is some crazy ass music. I get so there's no run button, I've noticed. Look at him. <laughs> Running along. Okay, where do I go? I'm guessing I just leave. Okay. I guess we go to Croy's house Croa's house, sorry. I've seen a character with that exact spelling pronounced Croy. Oh, I'm so tired. It's your own fault. Yeah, definitely Michelle. He's definitely a Michelle. Okay. Hmm? Huh? My Telemo? What? Another IPD cleanup? Is it just me or have there been a lot more of them recently? Yes, this is Kuroa. Oh, Kuroa. Oh, Kuroa. Sorry for the last trouble on your last mission. I know you almost retired having just returned, but I need you for another sort. What? But wasn't Crow already sent on a mission today? I know he's an ace, but don't you think you're working him like a slave driver? Sorry, but we can't go easy on this one. There's a large-scale IPD outbreak. The location is... Oh, interesting. Rakshak Resort. Private resort for the meeting of the Grand Bell. What? But isn't that where... Oh, oh damn. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Well, okay, so we're going to meet Cloche. I think Cloche is really badass. So, wow. I, I hope she's good. Because I really like her so far. That's right. Our maiden, Lady Cloche, is currently on vacation there. Her squad is already on their way. Y'all are to join the second squad. That is all. Oh, please, wait a second. Captain! What is it? Can Kokona? Really? You're gonna take her on a mission? I hope she can. Well, then, she, then again, she did just buy armor. May I take Kokona with me? Okay, so I guess she can fight. Because she did just buy some armor. Yeah, I'll have my permission. The more firepower we have, the better. I guess she's our first party member. I can go too! Yay! I get to kill things! Remember, this isn't playtime. I know that. Your life is on the line here, right? 
It seems especially dangerous this time. Make sure you're ready. Alright! Woo! Alright! Alright! But it sounds like Luca's voyage tomorrow will get delayed. Interesting. So it's not like Artinelico 1 that had a kind of world... No, I think Artinelico 1 was like that too. Where you picked uh, where you want to go out of um, certain choices. Rock Shack Resort has been added to the world map. Game data can be saved at the bed. Second floor. Save and load. Choose rest will recover all HP. Current objective will give you hints. We'll also find these options at camp circles in various locations. How to play one, Charlie. Check certain menu. Okay. No run button, but can I examine things? Damn, it did not like me saving. <laughs> then I'll probably mainly use save states anyway. So I can just save wherever I want. Okay. Oh, oh, I see. There's like the town here and then there's the greater world map. All right. not really letting me go anywhere else. Interesting, we're at the very top of the tower. Oh, except for this giant satellite here. Oh, I see. I have to use the D-pad. Rackshack Resort is way over there. Let's go. I'll use both away. It's okay. Thanks for gathering, elite fighters. This is an IPD outbreak suppression mission. However, I suggest you all brace yourselves for this task. I'm sure I don't have to tell you what's at stake. Our star of hope, the most precious life in this world. The Goddess Maiden, Lady Cloche, is currently resting in this mansion. Goddess Maiden? Didn't she hate the Goddess, though? Each and every one of you are responsible for keeping Lady Cloche safe. That's it. Now get to your positions as planned. Best of luck to you all. Roy, you're in the second squad too, huh? Yes. Man, you sure are tough. Even without a Ravitail partner. I don't need one. I mean, I know you're strong, but don't push yourself too hard. Oh, wow. Plus, if you end up lovers like us, your song magic gets immeasurably stronger. That's right, it's kind of like darling in the ranks a bit. <laughs> hey, enough. You're embarrassing me. <laughs> Sorry, honey. You just slipped out. Yeah, that's what you said last night. God damn it. I probably can't beat you in straight combat, but I'm confident that I could with her song magic. <laughs> I just love the rush from song magic. It's like an addiction. Well, I have to hurry now. See you later, Croy. Croa. Sorry, God damn it. Good luck.
We should hurry too. Hey, Krell. It would have been better if I was a raver here, huh? If you're going to say foolish stuff like that, let's get moving. He looks completely different as a knight than in his casual clothes. But if I was a raven tail, we could have someone stronger than that stupid couple. Because we're so closely related. <laughs> if you're going to say embarrassing stuff like that, let's get moving. Boo, you're far too serious. Crow is C stands for cool. Wah! Ah! It came from that way. That's the resort where the maiden is. What? I'm worried about Lady Lady Cloche. Let's hurry. Alright, let's get into some battles. How to play two. Okay, tutorial. Oh. Let's go. I, I, I don't think we can examine things. I'm guessing they're random battles. Because I don't see any enemies. You know what this also reminds me of? Octopath Traveler. Except without all the shadows and stuff. Okay, uh, so now the thing is to go, which way is the path that you're meant to go? And which way is the secret path? That gives you treasure. And yep! Obtain Ticklish Fluff. Gain 50 Leaf. Money is called Leaf. Okay. Game fix to leave. More leaves or more money than things. Music is so good. Seriously. Oh wow, it reminds me of the fairy tale themes. More money. Uh, right. Mini Puny Egg. Like those guys from Thousand Year Door. Let's see. I'm guessing the save point? Yep. You can even rest at the save point. Now, this is an RPG and there's only 12 save slots, so I'm just gonna keep saving in the same slot unless... Okay, that's obviously where we're supposed to go, so... Let's just explore around here a bit. Anything here? Nope, 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 nope. Let's keep going. This is... Damn, looks really run down and creepy for a resort. The resort's been fried. Oh, I see. Even an IPD outbreak couldn't do this much damage without quite a few involved. I have a bad feeling about this. Uh, don't say that. What? These armored knights? Could it be... Okay, let's... Oh, so they attacked us. And there's a raven tail. You're from the Sacred Army. You're a Grand Bell Knight, eh? I don't have to answer to you. On guard! Huh. Looks like they're not going to talk to us. It's no use. Kokona, let's do it. Okay. Battle menu by pressing triangle. Use items and change targets. Oh, I wanted to change targets. Oh wow, I can I can do both buttons at the same time. I see. Uh-oh. Ooh. 
I, I see. I, I, as long as if I see, I can combo shit. I see. You're gonna do shit. Okay, you're just hearing music. Kick her ass. Boom, 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 boom. Yes, there we go. Do, do, do. Okay, yeah, there's no burst because we don't have a raven tail yet. Oh, there's a guard score we can guard? I didn't know that. Is it like uh, is it like a Mario RPG where it's like a time guard? I don't know what that means. Those are just the enemies. Why is the sacred army here? Could they have? Hey, Crow. Do you think this is really an IPD outbreak? No, it's probably an enemy attack. And they hit it as that to not cause a panic or for like, or, you know, reasons for security. Not anymore. If the sacred army is here, there must be something else behind this. But either way, let's hurry. I'm worried about Lady Cloche and Captain Legless. Okay, let's see. We haven't gotten into any non-scripted fights yet. Oh, they're dropless. Yeah, that makes sense. Mini puny egg, too. I'm guessing those are for crafting or, or healing. Let's check out. Oh, well, looks like we got to the item section here. Pom pom milk. Like lawn lawn milk. More money, money, money. Okay, it doesn't seem like there's objects we can interact with in the environment, except treasure chests. And I don't know if random battles have been activated yet, but it doesn't seem like there are any. Oh, <laughs> of course I fucking adjust as I say it. Yeah, one guy. But mash, but mash, but mash, but mash. There we go. Kick his ass. Damn. There we go. Almost leveled up. I really hope we can get all our HP back when we level up, but since this is an older RPG, we might not. Yeah, no drops. I really love how low the encounter rate is in that case. I'm guessing where we have to go is there, so let's go everywhere else except there first. Now, let's because that's what you do in RPGs if anyone has seen that pro ZD skit. Hero A, is that a healing item? Yeah, probably. Okay, so the other stuff's probably for crafting. And again, it doesn't look like we can interact with the environment, except treasure chests. So, let's see. Do, 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 do. Checking out the treasure chests. The encounter rate is so low. I kind of like that, actually. More healing items, good. I think we're gonna need them if there's a boss, which there probably is the first boss gonna show up. Anything hidden behind here? Oh, wait a minute. Do you see that blinking thing in the corner? That's probably like showing the time and the footsteps or the time until the next encounter. I'm gonna rest. I see. Okay, so save points do heal you. Okay, but I'm be I'm guessing they all won't have that option, maybe. Okay. Yep. That's it. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Okay, so there's combos you can do. I see. I... Oh my god. Okay, wow, I didn't even need to do that. Damn. <laughs> Level up. Level up. Oh, 
Oh, damn. I didn't realize it'd be there. There's Lugless. They aren't actually Berserk IPDs. Leglius, can't you do anything about this? Captain! Are you all right? Wait, is his name actually pronounced Crow? You know what, I think Crow is just sounds cooler. Let me just pronounce his name as Crow. Because that also fits with his black hair and everything. Crow! You just got here just in time. Captain, is this really an IPD outbreak? My intuition tells me no. There's no mistake. Someone planned this. A mastermind? Yeah, mastermind. But before the chit chat, let's get rid of these bastards. Let's go! Hey. Yes, sir! Do we get him in the party? As a guest or something? Oh, all Rabbit Raven Tail. Oh, we do! Okay, they're all preparing. Kick ass, come on! Damn, couldn't defeat both of them. Alright. Okay, and our, my HP didn't recover. Alright, kick ass, kick ass. Oh, awesome. Didn't even get him at let him have a second turn. Okay, there we go. Captain, are you okay? Oh, is he gonna die? Damn, that's a cool character design, though. Hello, T. Welcome to the stream. Looks like I've used up the little energy I had left. Pro, listen carefully. This incident is not an IPD outbreak. It's a coup d'etat. What? Ooh. Coup d'etat. Our enemy is the Sacred Army. They're a rebel group formed by members of the previous government, which Chancellor Alfman announced ousted. The Sacred Army. Their objective is laid a close as life. We gotta protect her. I think she's super badass. Same, Jess. I really thought he was gonna die before he finished that sentence. Crow, another Raven Tail! Oh, is she gonna fight with us? <laughs> We're making any progress here. Crew, I got new orders for you. Hi. Yes, sir. I'll try to stop the so-called IPD outbreak right here, right now. You almost retreat from this place and protect Lady Close. Understood, soldier? But, Captain... Orders from a superior or absolute. Decide now if you want to follow them or resign to the knights. Hurry, Leglius. Do something now. Lay it close. I shall remain here. Take the responsibility for this.
But you're almost free from the place with Crow. Lady Cloche, please come with me. Wait a minute, Leglius. Are you telling me that this untested rookie will be my guardian? What? Untested? Crow is... Partners! They all can trust in his skills. <laughs> Guaranteed. Pro, if y'all manage to escape from here, lay low till the next full moon. Oh wow, so he's gonna get out of this alive. Meet me at the coal lodge in the Milker Forest on that night. Good luck! Yes, sir! Now, please hurry! I understand. Yeah, I don't think he's coming out of this alive. Crow! I trust her to you. Damn. Well, I think Cloche is super badass. So we'll see. What is your name? Cloche. Didn't he just say it? <laughs> Crow, man. So, Crow. Well then, Crow. Are you confident that you're strong enough to defend me? I won't know that until we actually fight. What was that? Can't you at least lie and assure me that everything will be alright? I'll never lie to you. Now let's hurry. Alright, is she in our party? Let's rest and get my little HP back, because I don't think there's any cost to it. May as well just use it at every opportunity. I gotta say, you know, I think, yeah, Final Fantasy X let you heal at all the save points, so... I love that, by the way. It really just lets you concentrate on having fun with the game. I see, so you can't even go that way. Rather than um, worrying about how many healing items you have left, it lets you concentrate on like the current, um, the current objective, the current fight, rather than trying to manage resources, like for how many fights you're gonna get in in a particular dungeon. And it also lets the encounters themselves be more challenging and varied. So I really like that innovation. <sighs> We're surrounded. Crow! Lady Cloche. What is it? Can you use song magic? Do you intend to insult me? I may be young, but I've been baptized as the maiden of the goddess Frelia and the Grand Bell. So is that a yes? That's not what Cloche said in the beginning. Didn't Cloche hate the goddess? Now I'm confused. Of course. Naturally. How many times do I have to tell you that? Then please, help us out! Huh? Wait, you, who do you think I am? That's a question that can only be answered if you stay alive. Crafting song magic just for a vulgar battle like this, and that would shame me as a maiden for the rest of my life. This isn't how Cloche, I remember Cloche at all. Was that scene a foreshadow? Please, help us if you don't want that life to end here. Once we return to the Grand Bell Hall, I shall take appropriate measures for this. Do you accept that? Crow, 
Here it comes. Though against my will, I'll teach you how to use song magic. Be grateful. First, select a song from those I've crafted. You must press the circle button to open the menu. Press the circle button to open the song magic menu. Then choose which song you want me to sing. Depending on the emotional trend, it will be either an attack or support song. Remember that. Now, try to into practice what I've just explained. I'll try an attack. So you have chosen to use red magic. Very well, after all. It is said that offense is the best defense. Red magic is a powerful type of song magic that is used to attack the enemy, with the powers that Raver Tail has crafted. The more time you spend accumulating power before activating the song, the more effective it will be. Do not forget that. I remember that from the first one. Now, let us begin. Make sure to listen to my song closely. Well then, Lady Cloche, I will distract the enemy. Once you are ready, please use your, lose your song magic and... <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you intend to ignore my feelings and fight however you like? Your feelings? Of course. You have the role of understanding the feelings of a raver tail and fighting according to them. That is, if you intend to become a raver tail's partner, no matter how temporarily. What kind of horrible treatment do you give to your partner every day? No, I... <laughs> I do not remember asking for your opinion. Just follow my orders. Oh, wow. Yep, Beatrice absolutely for her. Uh, understood. Well then, do you see the graph on the bottom right of the screen? It describes my current emotional state. It is called the Emotion Indicator. Make sure to remember it. This graph will fill up according to the action you take during your turn. For example, if you attack while holding the left on the D-pad, the graph will fill to the left. Once the graph has been completely filled in one direction, an effect will activate depending on the emotion you feel. Now, let us give it a try. Try to fulfill one of my desires. Oh god, I didn't mean to. If you attack, it'll make me stronger because it's sun magic. 
Never forget to make use of it to increase the power of a song. God damn it. Oh no, I, I didn't know that she was going to interrupt my attack. <laughs> the enemy is about to attack us. So you must guard me in a reliable way. I see. Once the enemy has begun moving, press the square button at the same time as the attack to guard me. You can judge the timing for pressing the button by looking at the gate that appears on the screen. I see. Oh wow. So it's like a so it's like a time. Oh wow. So we do have a timed hit system, except it's for defense. The closer you get to the edge of the bomb red ball, you get it. The more successful your guard will be. If you do it too quickly or too slowly, it will not work. So hurry and master this technique. Did you understand all that? Anyway, our opponents will not wait for us any longer. Let us begin! Yay! I got it that time. Okay. What? You cannot protect me with more skill? Their attacks are reaching me! I see. I got the second one, though. In this situation, I'll not be able to accumulate the power from my song magic as well as I've estimated. At this rate, we will lose. I'm sorry. When a brave attack receives damage, value in the burst gauge will decrease. Only on, on the other hand, a successful guard will increase the burst gauge, depending on how much damage you manage to block. And if you perform several consecutive guards successfully, the amount will increase even more. So please protect your Raven Tail as well. To retain the lead during a battle is important that you protect your Raven Tail. The further you advance in the story, the more difficult the battle become, obviously. No, I actually expected this to become easier, so that's quite a surprise. If at some point you feel the battle becomes too difficult, you just want to enjoy the story, it is a difficulty. Okay, I get attacked now, it's attack time. <laughs> There we go. Damn! I got a lot of it though. This should be sufficient. I will release it! Once the burst gauge has accumulated enough power, it's time to activate your song magic! Perform this action by pressing the circle button. Damn, okay, I remember this. <laughs> Here we go. Interesting, so she doesn't level. I'm guessing that's what the dive thing is for. She that's I think that's different than it was in, in one, in that they leveled. And she actually the Ravitail was more of a party member, I think, in number one, from what I remember. But it looks like she doesn't have um Oh wow, I actually got some Oh wow, I got a rare drop. Kick ass. Unless that was scripted. What do you plan to accomplish by making me use song magic? You're a knight. Have you have your raven have your Ravitail partner sing for I don't have a Ravitail partner. Uh. I'm just a weak little girl. <laughs> In that case, you should be ready to die. But if I really die now, there won't be anyone to protect you, Lady Cloche. Well, uh, <laughs> I anticipated this. Uh, yes. Uh, fine. In any case, we will be together only until we escape, and not one single second more in this entire adventure. I'm just gonna go home and not follow along in your party unwillingly. 
gradually getting closer to all of you. That's not going to happen. <laughs> I understand how weak you are well enough. Therefore, and despite it being against my will, I will use my song magic. <laughs> be grateful and bask in the glory of Cloche. You had better be great. <laughs> you had better be grateful. <laughs> yes. Thank you very much. Uh, well. Cloche has joined the party. Okay, now let's see. I believe I just got a rare item. Oh, it's the same goddamn thing. Fucking hell. Okay, and just the one weapon. Oh, so she does have HP. And coconuts is just fine. Funny scepter. <laughs> oh, I forgot to equip her armor. God damn it. There we go. Well, I, I think that um, I th maybe that part in the beginning was like a foreshadow or something. Like, uh, so we haven't actually started going against the goddess yet. Oh, okay, so that isn't a random encounter gauge. And I see, we choose our song magic in the beginning. You know what, let's, uh, let's have her heal us this time. Oh wow, only one hit, jeez. Oh, she does have MP. Okay, I see. Perfect. Hell yeah, perfect guard. I think we might kill him before the attack goes through. Yep. Rank S. Hell yeah! Okay, now we're ranked. Oh my god! Okay, so we got a bunch of things. Interesting, we got a bunch of stuff. So I thought that little thing in the corner was an, a random encounter gauge or something. I, 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 let's see, how close is everybody leveling up next? 55 EXP and Cloche doesn't level up it seems. Let's check status. Does Cloche love? No, okay, so Cloche doesn't have EXP. Interesting, okay. And what's that in the, in, what's that circle there? Huh, I, I wonder if that has to do with her die. I do want to, I don't know, I, I really like the battle system. I, I just want to get a feel for the battles, but it looks like there's like an anti-grinding thing built into this game where it's really, it looks like you have to really walk around. Oh, here we go. Just one more battle. Yeah. All right, now that we're all healed up, let's do a burst. <laughs> Oh, she didn't even use a... She didn't even use an offensive move. <laughs> okay, let's see. 
S rank. Rare Gurgo. Now, let's see. Okay, yep, cutscene. Okay. Uh, okay, so I noticed that not every scene is voiced. Wait. <sighs> Are you all right? Lady Cloche! Are you not doing well? I am all right. However, it is your duty as a guard to pay attention to my condition. It would be nice if we could take a break after walking such a long distance. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, with cloche like this, this is not the same cloche, clearly, that we saw in that other cutscene. I think that was like a foreshadow. That was, um, that was like a scene that goes later on in the story. Because didn't they call her the Grand Maiden of the Goddess? And then in that opening cutscene, they said she was against the Goddess. So yeah, I think that's like post-character development cloche. Maybe, th maybe they showed that, like, so you kind of get an idea where her character development is going? If so, I really think that's really cool. Yeah, I think that's probably a foreshadow. But we barely made it off the resort grounds. Kokoda! I'm sorry we weren't considerate enough. We'll... Oh, that's cruel. Okay. I'm sorry we weren't considerate enough, milady. We'll take a break around here. However, we don't know how far behind our pursuers are, so we can't stay too long. When a raven tail is in your parties, like rest the camp circle, maybe in a conversation. Oh, wow, well, that's cool. It's like tails a bit like that. It's important for story progression. Oh, that is so cool. I love it when they do things like that. I'll rest and then save. Speak with a raven tail. Close. Obviously. Excuse me, Lady Closely. In our giant camp as we're trying to escape from this area. Oh, she's wearing different clothes. I see. This is, this is kind of... Um, uh, gameplay and story segregation here. Oh, Crow. What did you need this late at night? What should I talk about? Dissatisfaction here? Oh, God. We got... We got choices. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I don't think she'd like uh, telling us what to do. But I think, uh, let's see. I, I think she's very dutiful. Uh, let's see. I'll... State your duty. Uh, well, it is to protect you, Lady Cloche. Oh, good. Okay. Good. Uh, then you do know what it is. Of course. That is my job. Yes, indeed. That is your job. Then how did I end up suffering attacks from the enemy during combat? Oh my god, is she gonna... <laughs> well, would she not say that if, if, I, if I got all the guards right? Yeah. I suppose I can take the situation into consideration and pardon you just this once. But prepare yourself for the consequences. If the same thing happens again. Oh, I see. Okay, we talk about everything, so it's not a choice. Okay, cool. It's just different dialogue options. Oh, that's nice. There is one thing that I simply must say. You. Y yes. Are you truly a knight? 
Though the situation may have left you little choice, how dare you force me, the maiden, into combat? Yes, that was... I wish that were the only thing. Aren't you rather lacking in consideration for women? Really, but no one has ever really said... Have I not lodging that very complaint right now? Or is it something else? Are you trying to say that I'm burdening you? No, I mean nothing of the sort. Understood. I'll reform my actions from this point on. Very well. In any case, take care that no such thing happens in the future. If I think of anything else, I'll have words with you like this again. So be prepared for it. Oh, this has turned into a real mess. Okay, topics need nearing. Oh, wow, topics can expire. And we got the first two. Okay. That is a lot of conversations. Wow. I think I do remember from the first game, now that I'm playing more, uh, these, a lot of them ha have like special conditions that are like almost impossible to fill. So yeah, we, I don't think we'll be seeing all of them like within reason, but uh, I will try to get as many as I can within reason. HP has been restored. Well, that's true, Ian. But I do think that, um, like, given that she's calling herself the Maiden of the Goddess, and then in the first scene she's like, fuck the Goddess. So I think that, uh, okay, so there's no random encounter bar in the corner there. So um, I guess that means no random encounters in this area. I think that that is probably a different job. Uh, it's prob that probably happens afterwards. Okay. If it reached here, it shouldn't be too much time until we get out of the forest. It was easier than I thought. Well, there were no random encounters. Oh, good grief. What a terrible thing to happen while I was on vacation. Uh -oh. Here's an evil guy. Let's see, what voice should I give him? I can talk from that voice. Unfortunately, it isn't so easy confirming the maiden of taboo. Taboo. Who's there? Oh, it's Sui Kun. Oh, God. What? Mitskemashtayo. Wazawa no Miko Sama. Honda to Kuru Mirashta. I found you. Maiden of Calamity. Never thought you'd be out here. Yeah, that's better. Oh, God. Oh, Lady Close. Oh, she has a sword. You, I have had enough of you addressing me as the maiden of taboo, calamity, and such like. Your rudeness is inexcusable. <laughs> Just as I've heard, you're a difficult lady to be with. You're, you're goddamn right. That firmness may be useful in front of the common people, but... It turns, it turns fatal at a time like this. 
Lady Close, watch out! Here we go. Now, here's a real boss. Start with an attack. Oh god, no, I didn't realize he was gonna attack first. God damn it. I'm so sorry. God damn it. Okay, so, so leaving it afterwards is worse. Okay, so doing it. Okay, so after you do, you do. It's better to go early than after, definitely. Okay. So don't so don't go for a perfect unless you're absolutely sure. Damn it. Shit, I'm dead. Oh no. Okay, well, at least I won the battle. And I still leveled up. Good. Okay, it's not the type where if one character dies, then um, you don't get an EXT. That's good. C rank, yeah. Okay. You're pretty good. Who the hell are you? This isn't the get the time for that. I will back off for now. Really? Now he wants us to protect her? Wasn't he just trying to kill her? Jeez. Just do your best to protect your difficult maiden until then. Hey, wait! He's gone. What was that? Lady Cl Lady Close, are you all right? Are you injured? Huh? I I'm fine. I was not injured. All right, that's good. I had to give it my all in that fight. I guess, yeah, I guess that's true, Jess. And yeah, yeah, it looks like he wants to be the one to kill her specifically, so it's that kind of situation. I guess my skill is still insufficient. I'll just get myself to training harder. Anyway, let's go. Once we reach the city of Ra city of Rakshak, we should be safe. Uh, you, Crow, was it? Hi. Yes. You were rather good. From now on, I expect you to improve even further. Those words are more than I deserve. I'm very grateful for them. Well, weren't we in a hurry? So, where are we going? We are going to the city of Rakshik. That way we might be able to meet up with Luca. Luca? 
ああすみません俺の幼なじみでそれで Oh, excuse me. She's my childhood friend and. Crow's girlfriend. Girl. Friend. So you h a n a s h e w a n a t e Tada, Mio k a k s o n i c h i k a r o k a s h e k r e t o m o t e Don't talk about her like that. But I thought that she'd be able to help us hide. You're blushing, you're blushing. Yep, I can sense a love triangle already. Well, weren't we in a hurry? Let us go now. I gotta heal up. You look like the lady at the dive place. Trade. Trade City Rock Shack has been added to the world map. Let's see. Oh, yeah, that's right. Gotta use the D pad here for some reason. Oh wow, cool font. Rakshak Trade City. Look at this. Wow! This background is amazing. It's been a while since I was last in Rakshak. Hey, Crow. Does this seem kind of strange? Well, now that you mention it, this place does seem to have a weird mood. Excuse me, but if we have reached town, then please take me to a place where I can rest. Lady Cloche, are you all right? You don't look very well. There is no need to worry. I just need a little rest. Hey, Crow, let's go to the inn. I'm worried about Lady Cloche. Yes, I remember there was an inn near the courtyard. Let's go. Yeah, oh, hello, David Lohman. Welcome. Yeah, that, that, that background was wild. Let's rest here. You can rest and save at the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They sure are covering for you if Arch and Elico 2 was somehow the first RPG you've ever played. Okay. Let's see what you got, Secret Army Knights. If you do anything weird in Rakshak, I won't keep silent about it. Okay, so. Let's rest. We can speak to Cloche? Yeah. Can we? Anything new to say? Excuse me. Lady Cloche? Oh, Crow. What did you need this late at night? Only one topic. Why do you not have a partner? Excuse me. A Ravatail partner. It couldn't be that you have deviant interests that would cause you to be avoided, could it? I'm not sure how you see me, but it's nothing like that. Why then? Perhaps you dislike women? Or you need, perhaps you need her to be a little girl like that Kokona? Could we set aside the question of a partner and first discuss your misunderstandings about me? Damn. Everybody, <laughs> everybody's like, duh, he's definitely a protagonist. Everybody's shitting on him right away. My God. 
Haven't missed any conversations so far, it looks like. Oh, you have something in the morning, too. Good morning, Lady Cloche. How are you feeling? Oh, wow, there's a lot more. I, I got to voice a lot more than I thought I would here. <sighs> Slightly better than yesterday, I believe. That's good to hear. I still think you should get more rest. Don't you agree, Quell? Yes. Which is the reason we need to get to Lucas' place as quickly as we can. How do we get there anyway? We have to ride the Souffle Access Railway. Again, sounds delicious. I wonder, is every is every place is is every place named after food? <laughs> The train station is at the Axis Courtyard. Let's go there first. Axis Courtyard has been added to the town map. What's gonna happen to Rakshak? Okay. okay. Now to save. I'll play a bit more. I think I'll do whatever I can and do I can do in this town, and then I'll stop for today. I really, I'm really enjoying this so far, by the way. I don't think Rakshak is a food, though. I think courtyard. God, that background is fantastic. Holy snaps. That's probably the goddess. I didn't save. Oh well, I'll save later. There's blue knights. Uh. Part of the secret army. I'm getting some bad vibes from them. Yes. The earth is somewhat tense because of it. <laughs> what could they be up to? I shall go and confront them about it. <laughs> oh my god! You know who Cloche reminds me of? She's like a, a female version of Luke from Tales of the Abyss. Oh, oh, Wait, Lady Cloche! Now what? If you go out there now, you'll just, you'll just get captured. Oh, I think that's the girlfriend. Because I think that's the other girl from the opening. What are you saying? Isn't that your duty? Saving me from getting caught? Bye, Apparition. Thank you so much. That's what I'm trying to do right now. Uh, yep, that's Luca. Uh, God, what voice should I give her? Damn. Oh, fuck berries. Uh, geez, 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 geez. What voice should I give, Luca? Uh, let's see. She sounded a bit innocent, so. Hmm. She didn't seem like you know, a haughty type. Like, well, that that slot is already taken by Cloche. So, what voice should I give her? I'll just give it a normal voice. A normalish voice. Um, uh, Crow? Luca? Luca? What's 
wrong. Yeah, Shannon like thing. Yeah, I guess so. But not not too Shannon me because that that the, that voice is kind of hard to keep up. <laughs> no, it's it's nothing. It's just just I I we I I, I think I'll stick with my voice for her for a while until I can feel something out. Just. just. It's just. In so long, so he never expected to run into you here. Who oh, is this, Bimbo? I wasn't emotionally ready, and uh, my heart's racing. Soka, Ponto, I see. You weren't supposed to come till tomorrow, after all. I'm in the Rakshak area because of an urgent mission. I see. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Luca, aren't you overreacting a little? No, I'm not. I, I, I'm really happy. Oh, it's not important to know the plot of the first game is what uh, I was I was told. <laughs> oh my God! Wow, she's enamored. Ah, oh, she has it. She has it really big for him. It's just that I can't look you straight in the eyes yet. Um... What's wrong? You're leaving us out here. Yes, you uh, are. So nice. Oh, sorry. Luca, show us you. My new house is coconut. Luca, let me introduce you. This is Kakura. The one I told you about before. Nice to meet you. Oh, so nice to meet you too. So you're Kakona, you're so cute. If I remember correctly, you help Crow out in his night missions, right? Uh, I guess. Thanks for taking care of all this time. Oh, no problem. And, um... Yes, I'm waiting for a proper introduction. And uh, that lady there. Um, I may be mistaken, but. No, I can't say this out loud, but she's. Hey, quiet down. <laughs> oh my god! We have the Lady of the Goddess right here? I can't believe it! Holy fuck! Wow! She's literally right here by the train station! Can you believe that she's standing right here next to this knight and this little girl? Unbelievable! Oh jeez. Jeez Louise. Oh, wow, I love all these characters. Sorry, I'm always kind of like this. Oh, 
You know what? I think you're right. I, I think a Jessica like voice fits her kind of well, too. I'll, I'll see what I can do. You know, it's the first episode. It's all right. Nothing happened. A good day to you. Uh, oh! Uh, hi! Uh, hello! Yeah, I think I'll, um... I think I'll give her a Jessica-like voice, but not exactly the same as Jessica. So, you're Luca. Crow's childhood friend and... girlfriend? If I, I really like Cloche already, and, and she, wow, both of these are great. I really love both of them. Oh, well, I'm glad for you. Yes, bask at my radiance. By the way, what do you do? What is your profession? Oh, there's a third Raven Tail. Interesting. Oh, cool. Oh, yes. I, I have the privilege of working as a dive therapist. D did you just say dive therapist? Yes, I take care of my customers' me customers' mental health and. <laughs> All right. How filthy! What a shameless woman! Dive therapy is such an indecent job that is prohibited in Pastelia! You let strangers come right into your mind? Aren't you ashamed? Uh, um. And you say it without any embarrassment. A woman like you having one of our holy Grand Bell Knights as a lover is such... Ugh! It's a disgrace to the very name of the Knights. Be ashamed of yourself at once! I command it! Necessary. I doubt I'll ever see you again. Famous lost words. Hey, Luca. Sorry to ask why you're feeling depressed, but... These blue knights, 
The Sacred Army seems to be acting a little strange. What's happened? Uh, oh yeah! Since yesterday, the number of knights increased greatly. Uh, people are wondering if the Sacred Army is put on taking control of the city. What? Hey, um, is the Sacred Army like your enemy? Yes, they are. So, isn't this dangerous? Yes, our situation is not very good right now. Luca, I need to ask you a favor. Can you hide Lady Close in your house for a while? This is gonna be great. Uh, of course! I'd be happy to! Uh, I'd be happy to stay with you too, Crow! Uh, yeah, definitely more you! Wait a minute! You! I would never go to the house of such a vulgar woman like her! Nor accept being taken under her care! However, at this rate, the Sacred Army will... I understand. Oh, oh, interesting. So Maiden is Miko. So yeah, literally a, a, a Maiden of the Goddess. Miko, I get it. As a Maiden, I have my pride too. I must learn song magic strong enough to obliterate the knights of the sacred army. You're trying to say that I'm too weak right now, correct? No, that's not what I meant. Crow! Yes! Dive into me. I command it! Hi. Oh, excuse me? <laughs> what? Uh, uh, um, oh, wasn't that a very bold request? Yes. You'll get used to it as, as long as you're around me, which will be more than ten more seconds. What is embarrassing about it? I was craft song magic for self-defense. I understand that, but... It's just like that saying, you know, Don't it to me! In the middle of town, it's kind of... <laughs> She's changing her mind completely. In, in a heartbeat. He's diving, not just the process of crafting song magic. Your thoughts on it are only filthy because of the kind of job you have. I, I guess I'm sorry. I would prefer diving to living under your care any day. But the root issue here is that Crow is too weak to begin with. What a useless man. I expected you to be able to scatter the Sacred Army and protect me! Yes, my apologies. 
Then, will you at least cooperate me to strengthen my song magic? Understood. Now, let us head to the dive shop immediately! I really love it, but... Uh, Duck Guppy Force, really, that, that is, I, I love their relationship already. Luke has joined the party. I can tell from the opening movie that they're going to get really close. The dive shop has been added to the town map. There are now two Raven Tails that can participate in battles. Song magical power up at double the speed. Do we get to use them both at once? Because I know in the uh, in the previous game, I don't think we did. The vanguards partner up with the raven tail behind them to take actions. Partnerships are formed by the pairs at the top and the bottom of the battle formation. The X and the square buttons are used for actions and guarding. We already knew that. Oh, I see. So now we can guard the bottom. Okay, so it's gonna get a lot more complicated. During the enemy's turn, each raven tail will need to be protected. The guarding, yeah, slightly more difficult than before. Yeah, pay attention to who's got, who's attacking who. Interesting. Vanguards and raven tail partners also have match compatibility. Partners with bad compatibility will each be less effective in battle. Information, you know, information, okay. RT Battle 3 tutorial. Okay, you guys. Well, I'm so glad we saw that today. Let's go to the inn first and save. For real this time. Okay, you guys. So next time, it looks like we're gonna go straight up into into their into Cloche's Somnium, and uh, <laughs> I am, this is just the the greatest thing right now to to get out of all the like the really dark shit that happened in Higginbana and other stuff. Like another reason why I picked this is that uh, I also thought it would be a bit of a lighter uh, change of pace from the rather heavy stuff we've been having in the channel previously. And uh, because after 17, we're going back, ironically, to uh, uh, Fata Morgana, even though, it'll, again, the prequel is much shorter. So uh, I really hope you, you like like this as much as I did, and hope we can have fun with it, because it's, it's a fairly long game, and I am really enjoying it so far, especially uh, all the characters seem really cool. And uh, again, it looks really interesting. Like, I really want to see where this goes. I want to see how close grows into who she was in the in the opening. All right, you guys. So until next time, I will say so long, farewell, lovely to say good night. You are all the sweetest of hearts. See ya. <laughs>